Yes, hello everyone from across the Caribbean, of course, you and social biology students. Now, today I'm going to go through some multiple choice questions. Now, these multiple choice come from 2006 Human and Social Biology. Now, the first question here, as you can see, you can see some diagrams there. First question is that related to that diagram. It is seen in answering items 1 and 2, match each item with one of the options above. Each option may be used more than once, once or not at all. So the first question is saying which cell is which cell transmit nerve impulses? And as you look at these cells, no C is the correct answer because this one basically looks like a neuron. Question number two: which cell is the male reproductive cell? And the answer for that is B. So this one actually looks like the sperm cell. As for A, A actually looks like the ovum or the egg cell in the female. Moving down to question 3. Which characteristic of living organisms may be observed by an increase in size? And the correct answer is growth. Question number 4. A group of cells which specialize to perform the same function is called a tissue. So cell, cells normally group up together to form tissue, while tissues normally group up together to, of course, form an organ. Let's move over to question number five. Which process is common to all living organisms? Sexual reproduction, asexual reproduction, photosynthesis, or excretion. And the correct answer for that question of course is excretion let's move on to the next question now which equation best describe the process of photosynthesis so this question I have to do with photosynthesis asking you the equation um, let's see carbon dioxide plus water sunlight chlorophyll glucose oxygen plus energy so C is the correct answer here. Let's go down. Yes, students. And before I move on to question number seven, correction to um number six. Sorry for that. Now the correct answer for that one is D. Now move on to question number seven. The which sequence correctly represent a complete food chain? Let's see. We have all of the food chains starting with grass we have a that said grass of a dog then bird for b grass then we have a grass uppers bird dog so um this one is the correct answer which is b there moving down item eight refers to the following diagram which illustrate a food chain in an aquatic environment let's see what the question is saying which of the organism in the food chain receives the least amount of energy so we have the food chain starting this direction food we have the weeds fish of course there now as for which food chain it would have it would have to be d here so d is the correct answer because as you go along a food chain the amount of food that is available or energy normally gets less let's move to question 9 now item 9 refers to the following diagram which shows the bones of the arm and it is now saying the bones label i i i and i i i r so as for the first one this bone it is known as the humerus so let's see which one start the humerus so either a or c at the moment Move on to the second bone. This bone is the radius. So C as the radius there. And the last bone is the ulna. So C is the correct answer. Moving on to question number 10. Bones are similar to cartilage in that they both are living tissues. So that is the correct answer. B is the correct answer. Question number 11. One function of endocrine glands is to secrete hormones directly into the bloodstream 
respond quickly to a stimulus, secrete hormones in duct. And the next one is saying produce hormones which get target only which target only one organ. So the correct answer of course is A which is secrete hormones directly into the bloodstream. Moving over to question number 12. The condition known as long sightedness can be corrected by using a removal of the lens of the eye, use a convex lens, use a concave lens, use a cylindrical lens. And the correct answer for that is using a convex lens. So that's the correct answer for question number 12. Moving down to question number 13. An example of a voluntary action is a knee jerk, blinking an eye, dropping a knife, turning on a light switch and the correct answer for that is turning on a light switch that is 13 questions out of 2006 monopoly cxe fast paper now please stay tuned for the next video which of course i'm going to continue with this monopoly so the next video i will continue with question number 14 so please stay tuned. now guys please remember to share the video leave a comment in the comment section so once again Thanks for viewing. Your teacher is out.